Hello guys, this is some chess from some random site online, you know. Uh, we got Bizman here playing some chess on some random site. That's your standard format chess style, which every site uses, so don't worry. It's literally like every site, even chess.com and even the big official sites like chess.com use this same exact format with the style, the brown-ish tinted colors on the chessboard. And basically we got Bizman here playing against some other random person. Uh, and basically he's just doing like a tournament thing. And he's basically just, uh, you know, playing. He might tell you some tips and stuff. He's going pro mode and this is supposed to be a crazy house or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so basically crazy house. So basically what happens is if you take a piece in crazy house, this tournament, you actually get to use that piece. So for example, you saw him just place down a pawn and just came out of nowhere. That's basically crazy house. Now there's only one restriction. You cannot put pawns at the top line. And basically this is a time format. It's still around 10 minutes. And this is just a game of like some chess. Uh, so basically you can, if he takes a piece, then he gets to use it. So for example, let's say he takes that knight up in the front that just made the move now. If he does something like that, then he can use that piece later on. So I'm just going to let him play. He needs full concentration for this chess game. And uh, good luck to Bizman. Hopefully he wins. You know, he's just going to maybe show you some strategies and stuff because he's pro player. You know, one of the best of the best grandmaster style. You know, playing against some other grandmasters. So let's just see what he does. You know, he knows all the different, uh, different like, forms and stuff. Oh, you saw him just take a piece right there? That piece now becomes... To that is the, not my piece. Yeah, not his... Oh, oh, yeah. Not Bizman's, but the other player, for example, can use that piece now to his advantage. And now we have a knight taking the pawn going in for the next move and I'll just give him concentration you know maybe he'll give you some stuff and right now this man's doing very well I think I can't really tell you you know um but yeah so just watch the game enjoy some nice uh normal chess and you just saw him put down a pawn that he just gathered and as you can see you can place it anywhere but you can't put the pawns on the last one any piece anywhere and it's a actually very strategic style a very different way of playing and this might actually be close to a checkmate. It is. No, it's not. He has pieces to block with. Look, he can place these pieces so it's not. A yeah, there's also one more thing which Bisman actually just reminded me about is that when you're in a certain checkmate uh, kind of format, it's actually not a checkmate, which is actually very interesting. You can use your additional pieces to get yourself out of a checkmate, which is actually very interesting. It changes up the game. Uh, makes it more intense and actually you can use those pieces to a huge advantage. Are these, which, I don't know what piece he puts. 